Welcome back in 644. The weather finally going to be a little cooler this weekend. So go enjoy the great outdoors with a view here in Carroll County. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this, Megan. In this morning's trips that make sense, we're going out to Westminster for a visit to the Sunflower Gardens. We are here at the Sunflower Gardens in Westminster. Not only can you walk through fields of spectacular sunflowers, you can see beautiful butterflies and also purchase herbs too. It is a pick your own flower garden. Uh, so whatever flowers you wish, you can pick on the property. Did you pick some good flowers? Farmer Dave runs the Sunflower Garden. He's been doing this for 25 years. It started off as a smaller garden and now he's got multiple gardens. Will you let go. You like can that? put him, Hold him yep, like that. Yep. And when you put him you can put him on your finger and then as soon as you let go, he's gonna fly away. Here at our gardens, we have a July that peaks, we have an August that peaks, and we have a September that peaks because he staggers the growing seasons when it, depending on when he puts the seeds in. Right now we have like the cosmos that are in bloom here. We have the butterfly bushes, they're always in bloom. All of our wildflowers still peak and bloom like throughout the whole season. So it's not just your yellow sunflower you're finding here. You're getting a variety. Hello bees. Uh, the um, bees are very active here. pollinating. <laughs> um, they, you'll see them everywhere. So you'll definitely hear that bzz, bzz, bzz sound mm -hmm. whenever you're walking through the gardens. They're really not here to sting you or anything. They just mm -hmm. want to go flower to flower. There's definitely a lot of butterflies, <laughs> a lot of insects. I've had people say, oh, a rooster got out. And I'm like, it's okay, <laughs> he'll fly back in. <laughs> we also sell the mason jars here. I love mason jars. Farmer Dave creates all the mason jars that are colored here. And then we have, <laughs> we have other random vases. Kids are always free. The $5 admittance, if you just wanna walk around, if you're picking up bouquet flowers, you'd pay $18. Also like a big thing would be that we provide the snips and like the things to hold your oh flowers in as you're cutting in the field and okay. then you come back to me and I kind of either so, give you water wrap it up so people don't it. have to bring their own like nope. clippers we have everything like here for you what kind of flower yeah. is that this is a dahlia oh. we try to make it family friendly bring everybody have a nice day out kind of thing we found ourselves a little kitty mm -hmm. how do you feel about the sunflowers I think he's about it and you have um, multiple places where you can get like photo opportunities, right? Yes. Like, yeah, he has some tractors in the field. There's actually a bathtub in the wildflower garden there. So huh? you can sit in there I'll if you want to. Sit in the bathtub. There's, <laughs> do it. <laughs> there's like desks, there's like all kinds of other random things. What can people expect when they come here besides sunflowers? Is there anything else? You can expect that you can just sit back and breathe and take it all in. It's just beautiful, serene. Yeah. Breathe and uh, bring you back to nature. Well, looks like you have a lot of new Instagram profile pictures that you can choose from. Absolutely. So pretty. So many photo opportunities, Megan. And I just thought it was so cool how I was able to let the butterfly yeah. go. You can pick them up and wow. just let them go. And not, I mean, you can pick so many different types of beautiful flowers. A bunch is $18. So wow, yeah, head out there and happy picking. I mean, really, absolutely. Great way to get outdoors with the whole family, have a lot of fun. This weekend is going to be perfect. All for right. That so this too. is the Sunflower Gardens in Westminster. Yep. Yes, All right. Well, Let's head out there this weekend. By the way, if you have a great place that we could feature on our next trips that make sense, please let us know. You can send us an email to storyideas at wmar.com.